Welcome to another teacher tip with Mr. Long and in today's lesson we're going to look at how we can insert a symbol into your Word document. So I've got this Word document over here and there may be times where you want to insert a symbol that doesn't exist on your keyboard. Now this is a very easy thing to be able to do. All I'm going to do for example over here I want to make sure that your buttons are 90 degrees from each other. I don't want to actually say degrees. I actually want the degrees symbol. That little zero that appears at the top. I'm going to put that over there. So how do I do it? So I'm going to go right to where I want to insert my symbol. I'm going to click here on insert and then I'm going to come across here to this side of here where you can see the symbol. We've done a video on equations but we're going to look at the symbols and you will see when you click here you'll see previous symbols that you have used. I'm going to click on more symbols just to show you where you can find all these lovely symbols. So over here, I'm going to come around and there you can see I've got the degree sign already selected because I've used it previously. But you can see all these other symbols and letters that you might not find on your keyboard are over here. So I really like that degree symbol. Where was it? There it is. Wait, there it is. And when you click on it, you'll also notice that there's a shortcut key for it. So if I press Alt and then 0176 on my keypad, not at the top, on the keypad, you should be able to get that particular symbol as well. That's a way of getting that symbol. So you can just click Click on insert and you'll see there it inserted that particular symbol. Now just so that you are aware there are some other symbols that you can access so if I come all the way are ah, particularly like web dings if you come to web dings you see all these lovely spiders and little pictures that you can insert into your document so you can go check out all of these and another option that you can look at are the wingdings options if you look at wingdings some lovely arrows and ticks and all that that you can insert um, wingdings 2 has some more and then wingdings 3 has some further more so have a look at those symbols and you can just click on insert some and then you find the symbol you want insert and then that's as easy as it is for more teacher tips for both the novice and the advanced teacher go to our mr long teacher tips youtube channel click on that subscribe button leave a like leave a comment we'd love to hear from you and remember don't do it the long way do it the mr long way